Hello, HGTV, and welcome to Seabween. Located in the thumb of Michigan, just two hours north of Detroit, Seabween is a quaint little town known for its agriculture, wildlife, and community. Seabween is broken up into two parts. The uptown, located on M25, and the downtown historic River District. Over the years, our uptown has been thriving with new businesses entering and heavy traffic flow. Our downtown? It could use a boost to help us accomplish our dreams. Over the past seven years, community groups have been working hard on a master plan to build up the downtown area and restore it to its former glory. Out of the 17 buildings that aren't permanent fixtures in the community, 14 have new ownership and are moving towards future plans. The village of Seabween was founded in 1845 by Reverend John J.F. Auk and has a current population of just under 2,000. Our town has been through many changes over time. Some famous landmarks Seabween is known for include the Michigan Sugar Factory, the Seabween Brewery, Hannah Hotel, and the Lincoln Theater. Although some of these businesses are no longer here, some of the remains stay behind looking to be brought back to life. We take pride in the uniqueness of what our town has to offer. When entering downtown, one of the biggest highlights is the bridge crossing over the Seabween River. The Seabween River is full of rich history and has created memories for Seabween residents. The river cuts through various parts of Seabween and goes out into the Saginaw Bay located in Lake Huron. The bridge is another highlight that has gone through changes throughout the years. Its newest addition showcases draped lights going across the bridge and through the downtown. The bridge lights have become a favorite place of photographers, amateur and professional, to get unique pictures of families, friends, senior portraits, or even wedding parties. We also offer a variety of activities for everyone young and old. Whether it be winter, spring, summer, or fall, the Seabween Harbor Marina is a highlight for fishermen, duck hunters, and boating enthusiasts. The Seabween Airport is an excellent spot for flyers to come and go. Bayshore Camp is a great getaway for kids during the summertime. And if you're looking for fun for the whole family, you can book a spot in one of our two local campgrounds. Victorian and craftsman homes still lay scattered throughout Seabween, with some even dating back to the 1860s. And the majority of buildings that still stand in the downtown area are filled with their own rich history and details. The efforts to bring life back to the downtown have not gone unnoticed by our community. This summer marks the fifth year for the Moonlight Madness River Fire and Seabween Lawn Chair Film Festival the third year for our annual car cruise and farmer's market, and the second year for our community-wide harvest dinner. So, HGTV, here's how you can help. Our intentions are to keep the historical feel we have created, but give it some modern flair that will appeal to all ages. Many buildings are in need of outside cosmetic work, New fixtures and paint are just some of the many things our downtown needs to spruce it up. A few businesses are also looking for help with interior renovations. Some are looking to start up from scratch, while others are just looking for updates. Another interest of ours is to add shrubbery, gardens, and green space to help liven up our downtown. Our current Mueller-Wise Park, located in the heart of downtown, is a perfect place to come and enjoy the day but it could use some improvements to provide venues for farmers markets and entertainment. We recently removed the remains of a rundown metal stamping plant. We have some new buildings coming to the area soon and maybe even a dog park. Even with those developments, we will have an acre of green space ready to be converted into a brand new park and family area. And with our river having such an impact through downtown, we would love to include some docking for boaters and kayakers to weigh anchor and enjoy the sights and sounds of our lovely historic river district. 
Sebring is more than just another small town in rural America. We are a community that is united by a heritage of hard work, service, family, and faith. We are proud of our business owners. Some have been here for generations, while others have been here for only a few months. We are proud of our schools that help us raise the next generation in a place where we know they are cared for and well-educated. We are proud of our police force, firefighters, and village workers. But most of all, we are proud to be the people of Seabween. We hope to see you in Seabween soon.